evaluate yourself like ask yourself these questions do you think so and so or this person will come help you in this certain situation What's happening, love gang? It's your girl Lala Love, and we got what's up? We got Cooley in the cut. Okay, um, as you can see by the title, we're gonna talk about some friendships. You know, because it's important to know who your friends are. Who who's your who's your day one? Like, who's really your friend? Who's really gonna have your back when times get rough? Okay, so. Make sure you guys stay tuned. If you're new to my channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, okay? Make sure you guys click the yellow bell beside the subscription button so that you guys will be alerted whenever I post a video and you guys will never miss an upload by your girl, La La La. Right now, me and Cooley are, we are going to the mall to do some shopping. Cooley, what is your take on having a best friend like what is the definition of a friend to you what like what do you expect out I, of I, I don't have friends. best friends I don't have best friends I have brothers okay I understand but what do you, what qualities and traits are you looking for in a friend like what does that mean to you I don't know you got my back I got your back I trust, you trust me I trust you like exactly like, like <laughs> the friends I go up is like Bergs, Moody, all those guys, and I grew up with them. So I look at them as my brother. All right, all right. So you got um, a little bit of a guy's take. I'm gonna tell you what I think. I think a friend should always be there, have your back, you? and vice versa. Yeah. Um, <laughs> anything else you want to add, Cooley? Like in a situation like you stuck, man, or really car break down, you call your friend, make sure like. Yo, yeah. Guys, yeah, like if I break down at the side of the road, I'm expecting to call somebody like to come help me as a friend because I would do that. A lot of the times, let me tell you guys why a lot of the times friendships don't work, and I'm speaking off of my experience as well, is because what I am as a person, how I grew up and my personal beliefs as how a friend should be and how I treat others. I put that on them. So I have high expectations thinking that they would do certain things, but not everybody was grown, uh, grew up like me, you know? Basically, like, I have expectations and that's a lot of reasons why my friendships have failed in the past because I've had high expectations of within a friend or certain friends and they haven't lived up to that so it's kind of like i cut them off like i cut them loose and stuff like that um drop a comment down below if you guys can relate i want to know your guys opinions and everybody has different opinions on this topic so i want you guys to definitely drop a comment like let me know your opinions what do you guys think a friend is like how do you guys think a friend should act um let me know in the comment section. Let's have um, a conversation. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up as well, okay? Give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you guys share this video. I feel like a lot of the reasons why I close a chapter within a friendship that I had once upon a time is because it's not because of their personality at all. Um, your personality is the reason why we were friends in the first place, but I feel like the certain moves that people make or how they act yeah, it's just I, not for I, me um and that's the only reason honest to be honest with you as to why um i don't have certain friends that i used to have in my life anymore it's just because we're on different roads like we're seeing different um perspective on things it has nothing to do with personality personality is the reason why we were friends to begin with so it has nothing to do with personality, um, but it has a lot to do with characters and the choices you made. And 
um, make sure you guys know who your friends are. Like, make sure you guys <clears throat> have friends that would be beneficial to you. Just make sure you know you guys can call those certain people whenever you guys are stuck. Evaluate yourself. Like, ask yourself these questions. Do you think so-and-so or this person will come help you in this certain situation? Give yourself these tests and really sit down and think to yourself, like, you know, that will, that will definitely help you determine who's your real friends, who's your day ones, all that stuff. You know, that's I've been doing that all my life. <clears throat> and I got two good friends, Kareen and Chanel. I'll post a picture right here, Kareen and Chanel. Those have been my day ones since grade two, since elementary. Like, I'm talking about 16 years and counting. Like, day ones, those are fams. I consider them my sisters you know and um all those things that i listed before make sure you guys do that to your friends as well because you want to make sure that relationship stays healthy it's not just a one-way stream where they're doing all these things for you guys and you guys aren't doing it back like you gotta prove that you're a good friend too you know um what i want to say to you guys is don't always have high expectations for people don't always think that because I do this for them they're gonna do this for me don't do that with everybody you hang around with because I'll tell you right now you're gonna lose friends quickly um, that's what happened to me like I had high expectations and situations didn't work out so make sure you know who your friends are okay like another way to test out on who your friends are and if you know they're your real friends get into situations okay I'm, well I'm not telling you go get into negative situations and like whatever whatever but I'm telling you guys when you're in situations that are serious in your life and stuff like that notice who's in your corner notice who's around you notice who's a phone call away and who's who will come check up on you notice all of those small things that will let you know who your real friends are. I I don't know about y'all but I'm also a sp spiritual person like <clears throat> so get you if if you are a spiritual person this message might be for you um do your friends pray for you do your friends um invite you to church and stuff like that because i got friends that do that um and there's nothing better than when friends invite you to the house of god to like worship and praise and to share your testimonies and all that stuff that is a good friend looking out for you okay because i don't know what other better thing that can happen in a friendship when your friend invites you to church like that's amazing that's awesome that's a good friend that you want to keep around because they care about you you know you know I don't know if you guys already know this already but I am the only child so growing up friends was a big thing for me like I've always looked for loyalty characters in the people who I invite into my life so um I'm very big on that um, and I'm not even gonna lie I'm not gonna lie that is a part of the reason why a lot of my friendships haven't worked out because I look for or I craved I don't know if crave is the right word but I've looked for qualities and traits of loyalty in a lot of the people's um, who I've associated myself with and it was just a fail so that is a lot of the reasons why my friendships have failed but um i'm grateful to this day i'm grateful to god above that i have the same two friends kareen and chanel from day one okay i'm i'm lucky i'm excited i'm blessed about this whole thing that i get to have these people in my life um so shout out to them and um I just hope you guys be careful like just be careful on who you invite in your corner you know another thing I wanted to add is notice the people who are silent or give off a weird reaction whenever you tell them good news about something that's happened to you in your life always notice the person's reactions at the end how they how they move how they feel how they react because I'll tell you a lot about your friendship with them you know so I just uh, thought I should speak on that topic, you know. Um, make sure you guys have a great, blessed day. Um, Comment down below. I want to know what you guys think. Like, 
I want to know what you guys, how you guys feel about friendships, and I want to hear your opinions. Everybody has their own opinions, okay? Um, and that's perfectly okay because everybody's different. Not everybody's going to think the same. Um, but I want to hear from you guys. I'm curious as to know what do you guys think about friends and your famous quotes on friends and what you guys think. So comment down below. I want to see this comment section blow up and let me know what you guys think. And I think that's about it for this video. Make sure you guys stay tuned, like, comment, share, and subscribe, y'all. Okay, I will see you guys in my next video. And I hope you guys take care of yourself, okay? Because that is so important. Love, gang, family. Take care of yourself. Make sure you guys stay blessed. And I will see you guys next time in my next video. Mwah.